I love this sign. It says the fish in the aquarium can be cut into pieces. He's like, don't cut me into pieces. So, I spent the weekend in Osaka and visited this Kuramon market known as the Kitchen of Osaka. Instantly, this place became one of my favorite spots. I'm gonna show you why. So this is the Kuramon fish market. I thought it'd be kind of like Skiji market in Tokyo, selling mainly seafood wholesale and filled with tourists, but I was pleasantly surprised as it seemed designed more for customers like me. The best part? It hasn't lost that neighborhood market atmosphere. So I really love this fish market. The reason I love this place is because you can go to all the different stalls and you can actually eat the fish or the uni or the maguro or whatever you want. You can actually eat it here just right in front of the stall. It's pretty awesome. At first, it appears to be a seafood market, but I quickly found out that there's so much more to this place. But to start off, I had to take down some oysters. Today. Look how big that is, it's huge. It's so big. Mmm. It's really good. It's so creamy. That's some good stuff. Also, since the market is known for seafood, fish cake oden is outstanding. <laughs> so, this is like a beefy tofu or something. Yum! Let's see this one. So soft. I can finish this like in a second. It's so good. Another awesome thing about the Kuramon market are the people. Watching merchants preparing their products is pretty sweet. If you're lucky, you'll get to see a fishmonger preserving fish by putting it to sleep. I was lucky enough to capture it on camera. Don't know if this is common practice in the rest of the world, so if you know, leave a comment in the comment section below. We're in one of the stalls in a fish market. What's really cool about this place is that they not only sell fresh fish to all of the local restaurants in this area, but they also serve like sashimi bowls which is pretty cool. And so we've ordered, it's gonna take a little bit of time for them to make it, it takes about 20 minutes as of this morning. The reason why it's taking so long is because they have to send out the fish to all the different restaurants before they serve us, but they also serve this like, very, very fresh fish bowl. So pretty excited for this one. I guess all we have to do is just wait right now. That was amazing. Nothing like waking up in the morning and having fresh sushi sashimi. I love this place. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you have any questions about Kuramon or Osaka, leave a comment in the comment section below. And if you want to see more videos about Osaka and Tokyo, like always, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.